Welcome on a big night for fans and spectators alike here in southern Spain at the Ramon Sanchez Pituan Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and with me for commentary is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And the focus is on one of the finest leagues in world football, La Liga. It's Sevilla facing Alaves. Thanks Derek, good atmosphere here. Everybody looking forward to what should be a really entertaining game. Well, this is something they clearly need to improve upon. I'm talking about the record away from home league. Well, two wins in 15 away games is borderline relegation form, that is. More emphasis on being hard to beat, turn out a few real defensive solid performances and really play with the team being the most important thing. That should start to turn things around. The Sevilla side as follows. Yassine Bounou is the goalkeeper. Lucas Ocampos plays with Suso in the wide positions. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. Here's the Alaves starting lineup. You know, many in the media have been talking quite loudly about their style of play and not everybody being kind about it. There are many who suggest it's negative. How do you see it, Lee? Well, listen, Derek, takes all types of play, different formations. Coaches try and adapt a system, soaking up the pressure, getting everybody behind the ball and hitting teams on the counter-attack. He's probably on the cards for this team today. Ocampos. Marcos Acuna. Here's Fernando. Johan Jordan. And now in Naziri. A good and fair challenge. Well, there to intercept. And offside it is. And the cross smuggled away. Johan Jordan. Fernando over the touchline for a throw in Navarro Bataglia Lejeune with it Pina Bataglia They've given it away. Ivan Rakitic. Fernando. Suso has it. Atención. Jesus Navas. Llamada a recepción al dueño de un sedán gris de marca italiana. Still pushing for that goal that would see them forge ahead. Good defending to prevent the chance. Marcos Acuna. Fernando. Ocampos. Rakitic. On to Jordan. What can he do from here? And that's sound goalkeeping. With the game level, let's see what they can do with this corner. Favouring the short one. 
That's how to rob them of possession. Battaglia. They might be able to get in now. Difficult to stop him. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Ivan Rakitic. On to Ocampos. And players waiting in the centre. A very effective clearance. And over comes the corner. Can he put it away? Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Well, when you sit off like this, you invite pressure. Marcos Acuna. Sevilla, possession, not a problem. But that doesn't lead to goals necessarily. They haven't created enough. Too slow up front, midfield, very average. The coach, he's not happy at all. He wants more from this team. Possession lost. Oh, good vision. Suso with it. Clean challenge. Ruben Duarte. Lejeune with it. Well, the electronic board showing one additional minute and making sure nothing untoward happened following the cross. The first half here comes to an end. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. So a throw in here. Fernando. Rakitic on the ball. Chance to play it in. And now Suso, Lucas Ocampos, well the keeper had to concentrate, the referee has given a corner. Well he'd be disappointed about that end product but he'd be happy they're creating a chance or two. They favoured a short one here. That's excellent defending following the cross. And now the delivery. What an absolute waste of a corner. Well, a chance here perhaps to invigorate their aerial targets. And short it is. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Well, the attacking options appear plentiful. But it can't get all the way through. Suso can't get the shot through. And the defender takes care of business.
Ivan Rakitic. Fernando. Still pushing for the goal that would put them ahead, but not forcing it. Sevilla have really dominated possession in the last 15 minutes. They really have put the pressure on. You feel their play deserves a goal, but will they get one? They need to just be a little bit better, a little bit more clinical. Navas hard for defenders to stop him. And that is how to block. And it crossed the touchline, so a throw in here. And they will make the change now. Rioja. And now Tomas Pina. Ruben Duarte. Really good reading of the game to win possession back. Oh, great vision. Ocampos. In position here to protect the ball. A routine save. Bataglia. Lucas Perez. Making excellent progress with the ball at his feet. Ball's gone. Fernando. And options in the centre. And the cross goes in. Smuggled away. Edgar Mendes. Not to be advised, giving the ball away there. This is why we adore this game. Late drama, and now they're in front. Well, it looks like the game is over, but no. There's another chance, and there it is, back of the net. It looks like the winner. Well, here's the replay, and Derek, if you get caught on the ball there, you should be fined a week's wages. It's terrible and he's punished. Some explaining to be done to his coach, I feel. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? Five minutes remaining, and one thing is certain, no one is leaving because it's still close. And played the pass well. Going about his defensive business with a minimum of fuss. Well, they worked so hard here to be in front, and that's been recognised by the supporters. They just need to hold on a bit longer to see this out. Johan Jordan on the offensive. And this is Navas. Here's Fernando. They really look after the ball when they have it. And that is going to be all for this game. And it's in line with how they've been playing away from home. Another defeat to digest. Well, Derek, it's a narrow loss, but it's still a defeat. The coach will be trying to talk his players through this lack of form away from home. It seems like it's a real psychological problem for them. Not great at all.